Hello everyone, welcome to another video from Robojax. In this video I'm going to introduce the servo tester. This is a tiny servo tester that makes your life easy, money time with your receiver if you want to connect or do something. So test the servo, test your motor. Uh, you need a receiver and a lot of complicated setup if you don't have a drone or if you have a drone you have to disconnect so many things. So this makes your life easy to test your your ESC and also make sure that you can test also your motor. So let's get started. You connect it through a servo cable that has 5 volts. So this needs 4.8 to 6 volts. More than that it will kill it. So by default it will be 5 volts. So the signal here it's labeled minus, negative, positive and S, which means the white should be on the other side and black should be on this side. So we can connect that way. And here it has three outputs. So it means you can simultaneously connect three different uh, ESCs motors to check them. I have here a battery, a three cell battery. My ESC is connected through this cable. So I'm going to connect it to my battery so I connect the battery to the ESC and now my, e my ESC provides 5 volts through this red and black so 5 volt is coming out of ESC so this is usually connected to flight controller or any other devices if you need that 5 volts with uh, depending on the type of the device around 1 or 2 or 3 amperes uh, you will get here so I'm getting 5 volts, but this white is a signal input. So remember that red is output from this ESC and this is input. So again here, S is on this side, that's negative, so I'm going to put the white here. So now this is connected. We have here three different modes. One is continuously. Uh, value and the other one is automatic the other one is manual so we have manual and then continuous and then automatic so these modes can be selected with the switch here I press it you see that's a steady that's maximum it goes to the motor motor is rotating if I go to auto it checks all values for the receiver as if you press your throttle uh, uh, back and forth so it checks it let me go to that so the motor is now rotating so this is a controller I can decrease it and increase it so as you can see this makes life very easy for testing your AC and motors uh, thank you for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe.